Um, I'd like to order a small cheese pizza, please. Hold on, will this be, um, delivery or pickup? Delivery, please. Uh, all right, it's going to be 1218. You're going to pay cash or credit? Cash. Cash? All right, I'll be there, like, in, um, 30 to 45 minutes. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Have a great night. You too. And there you have it. It's Pizza Week this week on Posters Paint. And this week I will be recording on my webcam, which I just got. And I don't know if you can hear, but that horrible sound of death is the fan on my laptop. The reason I am recording this week on my webcam instead of my actual camera is because I left my actual camera at my dad's house and he is out bike riding with his girlfriend this weekend. This isn't a weekend, this is Tuesday. This is Tuesday, but for you it's Wednesday, so happy hump day from the past. I hope you had a wonderful day up until this point and continue to have a wonderful day after this point. It'll be 30 minutes until my pizza gets here, for me, but for you, it'll probably be one transition later. Guess whose pizza got here? My pizza! Look at it. Look at it. They, they gave me peppers. And they remembered I like garlic sauce. I didn't even ask for it. They just remembered. Pizza machine is the best, you guys. The happy couple. Anyway. Since I missed my video last week, then I uploaded it on Thursday instead of Wednesday. We have implemented a punishment system, and as you will know from watching Isabel's video, my punishment is to read the first chapter of one of the original drafts of a book I wrote in the sixth grade. Now, said book, in my own defense, has evolved quite a bit from this point. However, nothing that happens in middle school is ever good, and that is why this following chapter will be terrible. In case you're wondering, said book is called June Flower by Aaron Goolseth. Walking home was my favorite part of the day. Copperfeather Rain Shadow and I all lived near each other and walked to our small houses from the hall together. I would always watch them walk, the others in our town. They never spoke to us, nor did we to them. I always thought they didn't like us because we were different, from different towns. They saw it as outsiders or not as all. For example, I'm pale and have dark brown hair. Gee, I wonder who this character's based off of. <laughs> Gee, I wonder. I wonder what kind of Mary Sue character. Oh, I've got to I've got to eat more pizza. It's like taking a shot but with pizza instead of drinking because I'm underage. I would watch them walk and imagine what they were thinking. I knew their names, some even their true names. Wolf Fang, Dusky Gold, Lily Leaf, I could name nearly everyone in the crowd. <laughs> I'm gonna cry, I'm barely even a paragraph in. I longed to know them, laugh with them, instead of watching, always watching from the shadows. I drew them. My room was covered in pictures of them. They hung from the ceiling and the walls. They made me feel almost like I wasn't alone. <laughs> Why was I such a depressed little teenager? <laughs> I'm gonna cry. At least I have pizza to love me. I'd even drawn my own friends who didn't really exist. I'd think of them during the day and explore with them in my dreams at night. My favorite of them was Lunar Ring, or Icarus, which was his true name and what I called him. We would often fly together in dreams, and who he is who I'd talk about when I'd asked about my best friend. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I want to go back in time and punch little me in the face. <laughs> Okay, so I honestly think if I read any more, I'm going to start crying because of laughter and also terrible writing skills. So, um, I'm just going to 
I'm just gonna sit here and sip my apple juice and tell you that I just finished an entire pizza. For the second time this week. This has been an official Fatty of Wednesday signing off. Have a great week.